Hi everyone, it's Natalia and Kathleen from Skin Blends, and we wanted to show you our new packaging for our essential oils and our aromas. We had the cobalt blue bottles with the white silk screening on them since 1999, and we have the glass bottles which you need for them, but the silk screening made them all look the same. So Natalia came up with a cool plan. So what we did here, these are our aromas and our essential oils. To tell them apart a little bit better, we have a colored background with a white band on all of our aromas. And then on our essential oils, they feature a white background with a colored band. So you can tell them apart between essential oils and aromas, and then each uh, bottle has its own color. So you can tell it apart a little easier that way too. If it's a blend, it has one color on the top and one color on the bottom, and then on the top, where it says the name is split in two, so you can tell that that's a blend of essential oils. I think that's pretty genius as well. Thank you. And they're coming out just in time for our August special, which is? This month we have 20% off all of our essential oils, aromas, and colors, so you can stock up and save. We are also doing a really special giveaway this month that you won't want to miss out on. All orders over $50 will receive uh, entry into our giveaway. And what are we giving away, Kathleen? Well, one lucky winner will win this rack and 30 essential oils, and the other lucky winner will win this rack with 30 aromas on it. A lot of the aromas are all natural aromas too, but there's certain aromas we just can't make out of essential oils, so we have both options available for you. What is the difference between an essential oil and aroma? Well, an essential oil is like the lifeblood of the plant, and it's the one that it has a lot of therapeutic properties as well as aesthetic values. And then an aroma, the natural aromas are essential oils in a sunflower oil mm -hmm. base and we have vitamin E to preserve them. And then some of the aromas we've had in the line for so long and years and years and years ago, all the fragrances were proprietary and there's a couple of them in there, I can't even tell you what's in there because it's proprietary. <laughs> so. Can you use else. both in a diffuser or are you only supposed to use essential oils? It really depends upon your manufacturer. I would think that if it's a natural one, you'd probably be okay in your diffuser and that's a great way to use them. Some other tricks is peppermint can be a temporary lip plumper. That's kind of fun. Or oh, part, that's fun. Helps with headaches. Um, lavender is soothing and calming. And to get more information about all of those, Natalia is going to be talking about one essential oil every day and posting, it, or posting some information on Instagram mm -hmm. and Facebook, right? Yes, so make sure you have your alerts turned on. We'll be posting every day of the month. Um, and don't forget to get your orders in so that you're entered into our giveaway because this is a really amazing value uh, for what you're getting. It sure is. I'm going to place an order. <laughs> <laughs> well, have a good day, and we will be checking in soon. How goofy was that?